So the question really is focused on the last slide, which talked about the Affordable Care Act and the role of emergency medicine physicians and the impact on the emergency department. I can tell you that I, I speculate um, first on the first blush because we're not quite ready. Um, nor quite equipped to be able to respond that we're going to have a surge um, of patients who will come into the emergency department because they quite frankly will not have the access to primary care physicians that they would otherwise need. And I think what that would, that would absolutely need to require is a conversation and dialogue with our primary care health partners in medicine to not run or shy away from, which I'm sure none of you have problems with getting your consultants to take patients and um, just embrace them into your practice. But that being said, there's gonna have to be a, a paradigm shift around what that would look like and ownership around patients who quite frankly don't need emergent care because the emergency room has I think lost that real focus of what it's supposed to be about. And I think it, as we look at it now, I don't have the numbers, the proliferation of urgent cares is certainly gonna be a, a way in which I think uh, people will be going. We're already seeing that now. Um, I think that it's also gonna help us think strategically about true education of our patients in the emergency department to as to what they can do for themselves, i.e. minor injuries. Have you really tried something before coming to the ED, such as analgesia, uh, that could have impacted your care. And I think, quite frankly, the dialogue is gonna, going back to my remarks on advocacy, require us to be at the table in those conversations. Because if we're not there, uh, things will just continue to evolve and happen in a way that's gonna be out of control, and there's gonna be an egress. They already predict a shortage of physicians coming up in the future, hence the growth of medical school classes by 10%, admittedly not really married and buffeted with the growth of GME slots, which is gonna be a problem, I predict, coming down the road, and something we'll need to focus on and, and, and think about. So I hope that answers you a little bit.